do something a little different here for today's episode. A new track, a new car, and then an old car, but a car that now I'm kind of starting to feel the flow of. Hello everybody, I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on a set of Corsa on a new Toge course in the Clutch Gang's new car, Slide and Vibe, an S13.4. So we're going to give it a full rip here, take a look at this course. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media, I'll in the description box below. I'll leave the link down in the description box below for the car pack as well as for the track. This car has got a lot of speckle in the paint. And it's pretty loud. So we're going to go full send. Make sure you guys follow me on social media, like I said, down below. Let's get to it. I have no idea. It's got a very clunky gear. Not sure how this is gonna go. That sounded pretty, pretty fun. Right, let's go. Track I just saw in Vossen. It's been a minute since we've been on the Vossen page. Taking a look at some new stuff. Figured I'd bring out some new stuff here today. Slide on new Toge course, but we all know I love Toge. Not for uh, becoming a lawnmower though. While we're riding that wide. We're rocking the R21 here for today's episode with the NRT Innovations Deep Dish Wheel. Ooh, big shout out to Moza and NRT Innovation for being continued supporters of the channel. Ah, uh, we're a lawnmower. It's not being a lawnmower. I think it just sounds like it's shooting gunshots off on a red line. We're just kind of assaulting this course. I have no idea where I'm going. Kind of flying by the seat of my pants here. I've got a little parking lot here though. We can go through that guardrail? Alright, I thought we were gonna hit the guardrail. Apparently we can go through that one. I'm gonna try to do a cool like 360 thing in there, but it didn't go wide enough. And we don't have enough power. You come to a parking lot, you gotta like I feel like donuts are a burnout, but unfortunately we kind of screwed that one up. Let's take that out. That gear plunk in this car is super cool. I say we lawnmower, we really lawnmower in this track. It's a pretty fun course though. I believe we're back at the start. Yeah, we are. Definitely like how this car sounds. Try not to be a lawnmower so much this time. out there. Oh. Oh no. Look at thumb stuck in there. That's a bad way to use that steering wheel. Oh. Wall tap. Especially uh. Oh I wasn't paying attention. I was looking away. I feel like this track would be super fun in a competition car. We have to bring a comp car out here. I can't get over the gear clunk in this car though. So a lot of cool cars in the Clutch Games pack. I've been running with Clutch Games back a long time now. Been in a bunch of the servers doing some stuff too. We get right this time. There we go. For a long time back, a while ago. 
It's always constantly in the server driving with them, so it's great to see them bringing out the cars. Definitely like this S13.4. Guardrail. So let's switch up to a comp car and uh, see what we can do with that one. And when I say comp car, I mean that of the Power Stops VDC car of Ryan Literal. Let me see if we can't keep this thing in the revs and see if this car can slide this track. Because, you know, boosted cars, I mean, don't always get along. And that uh, seating position, though. So we're going to keep this thing in revs. My little old car, definitely a uh, very aggressive car. Right there, we kind of fell out of revs, and so we there. And these high boosted cars is not something I'm super familiar with. I give Matt credit to those who do. Of grass, because I just kind of see want to fall boost. Like most of my top cars are V8, so we were up that. Slowly getting the hang of it though. The track is super fun though, even in this car. A lot of clutch kicks though. I think I'm slightly getting the hang of this car. If I drove this car a little bit more, I might be able to uh, fully get a handle of it. So something a little different here for today's episode. A new track, a new car, and then an old car, but a car that now I'm kind of starting to feel the flow of. I'm actually uh, quite impressed with this lap so far. I'm gonna try and finish this lap without falling out of boost or drift. Oh, as I say that. As I say that. Oh, man. So I think that's gonna do it here for this episode. Here on a set of course. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys want to keep seeing more like this, let me know down in the comment section down below. Oh, boost out of fail. So as always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.